I think it's the best hero I could have randomed. It's okay with techies, you know, swap into mines and shit. Also, it support is what we needed. Also, not just a support, it's a support that does stuff early on. Roaming, um, supporting, roaming stuff. Which is nice. It's exactly what we needed. Oh god, that's appeal. Do you need tangos? I bet you do. I'm gonna give you some. I'm gonna buy the courier and I would like to have a smoke to go mid and gank. It's in the bag. Because my stun is a very it's good setup for bag. Lina's stun. Any stun is a good setup for Lina's stun. So it's like my stun, Lina's stun. Lina's Dragon Slave, blah blah blah. Anti Mage did start with a lot of region. I like that because there is going to be Undying offlane, but you don't know who else. I think Bane will be here too. And Enfeeble. Enfeeble on Anti Mage, so he can't last hit. Bane undying would be an annoying combo. That would be annoying, pretty annoying. Oh wow. When did he play so many? This is so weird nowadays. He he places so many mines so fast. They don't do that much. It's like half damage and half cooldown but also half mana cost so 1 2 3 4 5 mines that's 750 damage one more mine will be enough to get a kill oh just kidding you are playing against a phantom lancer obviously he will send illusions oh well Oh well. The battle begins. <laughs> Anti mage crazy. He did get the bounty rune, but I'm sure it's not worth it. At least we know Bane skilled uh the nuke instead of Enfeeble on level 1, right? I need to go pull. The the lane is pushing. We have two mega creeps. I mean, uh, <laughs> two mega creeps. We have two ranged creeps, and the camp is blocked. I do not have sentries, so I guess I'm gonna stay on the lane until I get level two, and then I will go gank mid. What's up? Yeah, level 2. Bane is now level 2, boys. Double kill on the techies. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Lina died mid. Okay, Lina definitely needs help. I'm gonna help him, I think. Oh shit, did we just get dual, double? Let me stretch my wings. 
double uh, decayed. It's a double damage. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I died. Anti mage got a kill on Bane and he killed the tombstone, so I guess that's alright. Guess that's alright. Oh, smoke is on cooldown now. Rip. Yeah, yeah, this is totally a worth trade. I mean, I died, but anti mage kill and tombstone kill. Totally worth it. Um, why am I going here? I should be going bottom. The only way to gank mid is with smoke. Otherwise, no. Otherwise, no gank. Techies Invoker. Two ranged heroes with... Um, two ranged heroes that should be pretty good at harassing the PL. I'm gonna go for the 4 minutes rune, this Bane is not checking runes at all. He is checking runes. Bounty. Bane is back bottom. I wish you could give runes to teammates. Now he would give me the the haste. Like a promise of revenge. We can burst this guy with Lina's ultimate stun. Well, if I only get the chance to stun. I guess he got him. I actually can't do much bottom lane. I prefer I prefer pressuring mid or something. Let's put a ward here. Uh Techies has suicide up, so let's see if we can suicide on someone. Push, we gonna suicide. I can stun. Bane is top, nice. AM3 farm now. <laughs> he, j he keeps giving him free gold. Nice.
This invoker's right click is actually insane with my aura. <laughs> Bottom tower is under attack. Um, more TP's bottom? Never mind. We should defend that. Your bottom tower is under attack. It was Your bottom tower is under attack. Your bottom tower is under attack. Your bottom tower is under attack. The tower is not deniable yet. Your bottom tower is under attack. Radiant structures are fortified. Your bottom tower is under attack. Your bottom tower has fallen. The enemy's top tower has fallen. Fair, fair. Get him! Get him! Nice. So many worth it trades. So, so many worth it trades. Anti mage is 4 2. It doesn't matter at all that I'm 0-3. It's always my death for... Always my death is for like... Anti-Mage getting a kill plus a tombstone. Or getting a kill plus bounty rune like the last one. He actually missed his auto attack. Your middle tower is under attack. Hmm. Huh. There is a lot of farm bottom. I don't know why I sent him mage mid. PL with power treads. Power threads, Morbid Mask, Morbid Mask. I think I will get Medallion, it's just really good on Vengeful Spirit. The damage reduction from this plus the Medallion is so much. Your top tower is under attack. Oh, they de-warded my ward, huh? Your top tower is under attack.
This guy's going agonims, maybe. Damn. Lion is going bottom. Never mind. They are three mid. I am very close to level six. Very close. Probably you two creeps. Or one. I thought he's gonna try to snipe me with a power shot. Your middle tower is under attack. That was a pretty close situation and a very, very nice one for us. I don't know if Lina died. Maybe. That's not good if he did. Your top tower is under attack. I think I should try to protect the team. Oh, never mind. I should try to help Lina. Your top tower is under attack. All right, I will deward. I really, really wish we had a s another support in our team, but I will deward. It's very obvious. I saw the Winter Runner warding. I guess it's it's going to be worth it. I hope so. In the beginning of the game I was like good thing I have this roaming hero but maybe a very very good lane support could have been better to support the anti-mage. He's close to the battle fury and he will have it soon and then he will be a farming machine. He will be a farming beast but I think it's okay. Uh, it's alright. VS is pretty good too. The thing is that my ganks didn't work out. I couldn't gank the mid lane a single time. I couldn't gank the mid lane a single time. I couldn't gank top. Like I did gank top but the gank was not successful. So it's those kind of things. Oh wow, the armor reduction. The reason why I maxed Wave of Terror by the way is because of the armor reduction. The stun is like, the damage scales pretty well I guess, but it's not damage what we need. And the stun duration doesn't scale well. It's only 175 at level 4. But the armor reduction from Wave of Terror is so much. In a combination with Medallion, I will be reducing their armor by like like 15 or so. It's 6 from Wave and 7 from this. That's a lot of... Uh, a lot of armor reduction. I TP'd base earlier, so I don't get ganked. Now I don't have any TP to help anyone. That was a 1 for 2 trade, I guess. So it's nice. The techies bought some sentries and observers. Very cool, very cool.
I don't have anything to heal this guy. Go take the region. I won't farm this. Yeah, it's fine. He has the battle fury up. Your middle tower is under attack. Radiant structures are fortified. The anti mage can split push a lot more when I'm here. Dire structures are fortified. It's so good when when I'm around him. Because he will be able to split push a lot more and force people to rotate. This is what anti mage wants. He wants people to rotate and defend. Defend the lanes that he's split pushing. That's uh, really well done. Oh, I should have. Should have used the wave earlier to stack. I didn't notice. Suicide on the ground. Suicide on the ground. You don't have to target the hero. My techies is extremely bad at the hero. My techies has never played techies before. Also, I could have used the wave here. It was also my bad, but he. He is not suiciding, he's giving them free kills. You don't have to target a hero, you can suicide on the ground. He's actually the real one pushing? What? I had a ten ten charges magic wand as well. Ah, uh, fucking, not 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 paying much attention. I guess I don't know. Playing bad. Just stack as many mines as you can and I will I will reduce the armor. We can easily kill Roche with Techies. We go when you have like twenty mines or so. The thing is that you cannot tell how many mines he has. I can't tell how many mines are there.
That's uh, three ultimates on me, guys. Your middle tower has fallen. You guys need my armor reduction. I don't know what you're doing in there. You need me to kill Roche. This is so fucking game losing. I don't know what's happening in this game. Your top tower is under attack. Your top tower is under attack. Radiant structures are fortified. Your top tower Haste. is under attack. Your top tower has fallen. Good thing the undying yellowed with Jim. Now he lost it. Go Roche guys You guys should have waited for me like that's so game losing You should have waited for me on Roche At least they lost the gem I guess No Bane ultimate. Overextended, I guess. Yo, 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 there is nobody there. Okay, I guess that guy. Oh my god, man. So bad. There is no reason not to buy back in the last fight, by the way. No reason to not buy back. I haven't used my swap. This is the typical overextended chase. After we kill Digis, we should have just backed because Bane is respawning and he came back. Uh, Bane is Bane respawned and tip it to the tower. PL. We wouldn't have killed him, no matter how much we chase. At least, meanwhile, Anti-Mage free farmed. He split pushed mid. But Windrunner is really fat. He has uh, Aghanim's Crystalis blink. Very soon Daedalus, I guess. I actually think we win this game.
Why do you people not use your Yule Scepters? Invoker Yule the Windrunner instead, not yourself. That would have saved your life and gotten us a kill. No, there are no shots, mate. You will him. Not yourself. What the fuck? It's a... Uh, 3v2 guys, 4v2 Get him, get him, he's alone Windrunner is coming, he will TP here, I think. So get back. Alright, nice. I go to glory. <laughs> What Lina wanted here is to give me the bottle, so I, I bottled the bounty rune and that's what I should have done. But I actually just took it because I thought he wanted to take it. That, that, um... This guy is 4 to 13. I actually haven't seen him suicide more than once. He suicided in the early game, in the beginning he had a double kill top. And after that, he is feeding non-stop kills, like... He didn't listen to me the first time. So he might have me muted or something, but... Can't my teammates just tell him? Guys, tell Tech his... Did I say 13 kills? Okay, 12. Not 13. 12. Same shit. Oh, what the fuck? 
Solo players gonna be solo players Dying forever, man. Can we just... Oh, wow. He actually got the real one down there. If the real one came up, he would have died for sure. Gem guys. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Take his Tech is nerfed. Tech is nerfed so much. Oh wow, there's a Bane there. Ah, uh, they cannot kill him. The wind runner even tip it to the tower. I did not see that. There is a uh, invis in his bottle. He's gonna try to gank people. Wind runner has invis in bottle. No damage to creeps at all. <laughs> Fucking tech is nerf, man. Did I just block? No, I did not. The gem is on Invoker, nice. What's this guy going to buy? I think this is a uh, Abyssal Blade game. After, after Battle Fury Manta. Blink on Windrunner, burn mana, kill. Your middle tower is under attack. You would go hard because you're scared of Windrunner? Hmm. 
Heart is not bad, I guess. <laughs> no. Heart is HP. Oh wow, he's so dead. Nice. Your middle tower is under attack. Radiant structures are fortified. Heart is just HP. Your middle tower. And Windrunner has really good attack speed from ultimate. I don't know, I think the item here is Abyssal Blade. The techies is offline on Steam. I think we just have to go without them. What? <laughs> Rib blades. Antimate. This is after blink, I'm sure. Yeah. This is right after a blink. I just wish my anti-mage would stop farming one day so we can end this game or can we? Instead of going with him I should go with with others with the Lina, the, the invoker Need to get out, anti mage. Get back. Tis mine. We have two gems. You can use one, and even if we lose it, it's okay. Techies is gone. I think he left. After so much beat. What's the point? Oh, he went for a heart. Heart of the Rusk. Oh, he came back. Wow. I thought he's gone. I actually thought he left. Hmm. 
My bad. Exhort, exhort invoker. Oh, yes. Let's go force the buyback. Or get a free tower. Oh, what the fuck? Where is Invoker? Uh oh. I think you're dead, mate. Maybe Invoker cleans the house. Lina is going for a South Curus. He has Aghanim, Shadow Blade. <laughs> AC on Lina. I think I'm gonna carry one gem. This Techis is. <laughs> I wouldn't rely much on this Techis anyway. If I lose the gem is no problem. A gift from the goddess. This game doesn't have to be this long. I don't think this game should be this long. I think we should have finished already. But we're having a lot of problems with team play, I feel. There is not much team play over here. And Vengeful Spirit is a hero that 
you do get a lot of deaths because saving teammates with swaps and just one day take his will suicide boys one day Kill the PL. Go Mega Creeps. You're fine, PO is dead. I have swap for you. You're fine. The enemy's top barracks has Go bottom. PO is back soon, guys. Yay! Got him! We fucking won! Easy 5.7k player. Well played. Wait, is Tech is the 5.7k? No way. Yes, he is. Okay, nice. Nice. Techies is not even a hero now. That's true. But Invoker is at least. That's also true. Techies is not a hero, but Invoker is. Yay! 3 12 12. It's alright. What matters is that we won. And I did my best to keep the wards up, save teammates sometimes, and I don't know what else. I did some very useful communication too, I hope.